Hey guys, so I'm not trying to sell you guys anything. This is not a partnership with anyone. This is just literally me with too much time on my hands and I'm getting ready to go to the Independent Spirit Awards and I'm gonna do my own makeup and I thought this would be a great opportunity to do an eye tutorial to show you guys how to achieve the fox eye. Anyway, so we'll begin with skin. I don't like putting makeup directly onto my skin. So I'm going to use this active serum as a barrier. I'm going to just put that like everywhere. It burns a little bit, but it gives your skin a really, really nice glow. Um, that'll kind of just leave you feeling like dewy. Um, when that is dry, um, I usually do like a lot of other things, but I'm not going to sit here and waste your guys' time. Um, okay, so for my skin, I'm going to use this Luminous Silk Foundation, Giorgio Armani. Makes really beautiful foundation. And yes, I'm gonna put it on directly with my fingers because it's really not that serious. Oh, okay. I promise I'm gonna look bomb when I'm done. So now that that is on, um, I'm gonna go in a little bit, like right there. It really is like painting. It's art anyone that says differently um then I'm gonna do just a little this right here I don't do a, a ton of contouring I just very little this is Westman Atelier which I really like it's kind of like a bronzer stick and then I'm just gonna go in like that and just do a little definition not too much um and then after that I'm going to, oh, I love this stuff right here. It's by this brand called O. Um, and it, it's this like clear, it's blush by the glass. And it, it's, it looks clear, look it's on my nail. But then you put it on. I don't know if you can see it it's very light pink I already have rosacea so I don't really go too much with the blush because and then why not just a little highlighter there okay fab what else okay eyebrows um I don't do too much I prefer skinny brows they're just like hotter and I like to go in at the top really lightly um, and then with this side of the brush, just like blend it in on my skinny ass brows. Okay. <laughs> it's hard to do it in the phone mirror. Okay, then I'm gonna do my lips. I'm gonna start with a little liner, and I'm gonna go for like a nude lip. So I'm just gonna line there. Honestly, I'm gonna look so bomb when this is done. So, okay, then I'm just gonna put chapstick over it. I'm going for just a stain. Okay, now the fucking hard part. Or you know what, actually, let me do a little bit more skin. I'm just gonna go in with my Charlotte Tillsbury um, 
bronzer palette. And with the lighter one, just kind of go in there and there. And with the darker, we're gonna do the double chin area, line the jaw, maybe hit there a little bit again. Why not? Okay. Um, okay, let's get down to business. Why you all came here. Okay, so I'm using my Pat McGrath palette, this new palette she sent me that I'm fucking obsessed with. Like, look at these colors. Okay. Um, now, what's very important with the fox eye is that you really want to follow the shape of your own brow. And then I'm gonna make it I might have to go in with the pencil to make this a little sharper, but like, <sighs> tutorial's over. I'm done. No, I'm just kidding. I didn't get this far for nothing. <sighs> That's why you should always do the eye before skin. Um, but I just didn't want to be like this close to my face without any makeup on. Um, anyway, back to the eye. We'll fix the skin later. Who cares? This is a total flop. Also be prepared to do this a lot when you're doing big graphic makeup like this. You know, it's really all about symmetry. Okay. So now that I have my shape, I just want to go in and make it a little more defined. you guys hear Tyler Henry in the background? Tyler, if you're hearing this, 
Please invite me on your show. I have more dead friends than anyone. Sorry, this video is so long and boring. I'm like so concentrated right now. Don't fuck this up. in with uh, makeup remover.
Okay, now let me just fix my eyes. I'm not gonna wear too much mascara because I get emotional at award shows and I'm probably gonna start crying. I do want to darken my little freckle here. There you go. Okay guys, this is it. What do you think? Also, this is what I'm gonna do with my hair. So, oh. with my armband. I love it. I think it's fierce. I don't give a fuck what the haters say.